Hey Calvary, hope your Thursday is off to a great start. My name is Robert and I have your word for the day. So we wrap up our Transform series and conclude our look at vocational health. You may find yourself in a place where you need or maybe you're just looking for some wisdom or guidance. Maybe you're facing a decision at work and unsure how to handle it. Maybe you're even considering changing jobs or vocation. Maybe you're looking ahead at your life and wondering, how do I continue to put into practice the things that I've discovered over the last seven weeks of this Transformed series? If that's you, if there's any area of life, parenting, job, anything where you need wisdom, I want you to hear Proverbs chapter 2, verses 6 and 7. It says this, it says, For the Lord gives wisdom. From his mouth come knowledge and understanding. He stores up sound wisdom from the upright. He is a shield to those who walk in integrity. I want you to hear two things in this today. First, no matter what you're facing in terms of your decisions and guidance, know that God is your so source of, of hope and of help. God is the one who can lead you, who can guide you, who can instruct your paths. So if you need wisdom, go to God. Go to him with an open mind and an open heart, not not asking him to confirm what you already want to do, but asking him to really lead and guide you and instruct you. Secondly, we see here the need for integrity. And as we specifically look at our vocational life and what we do at work, know that God cares about what you do when no one is watching. God cares about us making ethical and moral decisions. God cares about how we treat our employees, our customers, our coworkers, wherever we find ourselves. This proverb states here that when we trust him and walk in integrity, he is a shield and a protector for us. So I pray that you would pursue God. That no matter where you find yourself, you would walk in character and integrity and you would glean your wisdom and insight in, in leading from God. Thanks for watching Calvary. We hope you have a great day. Hope that God has transformed your life over these last seven weeks. We'll see you tomorrow.